Hey, how you doing? Austin here. I am not a financial advisor. This video is for entertainment purposes only. In this video, I'm going to be talking to you about the three reasons that I love Cardano and the three reasons that I buy in Cardano and that you might want to consider to do the same. Of course, this is not financial advice and this video is just for entertainment, but I really wanted to come to you and talk to you specifically about Cardano. Cardano is one of those cryptocurrencies that really, in my mind, stands out from the rest of the field. It was built from the ground up by Charles Hoskinson to solve very specific problems um, related to blockchain technology and things like that and also with the eye towards helping making the world a better place and I just love the overall uh, use cases that have been built around Cardano and what it is meant to do so I wanted just to have a conversation with you specifically related to that and maybe open your eyes to some things around Cardano. So Hoskinson, the, the creator of Cardano, had called it, has called it the Swiss, or Swiss Army Knife of Protocols. I love that because the, the, the overall technology that Cardano, uh, is it, what it was meant to do was really to help, help developers build applications that could solve a tremendous amount of different issues and problems from, you know, like from preventing counterfeit medicine to helping, um, you, you know, enable access to microfinance to helping developing nations uh, with identity management. There's a, just a list that just goes on and on and on uh, that really, you know, stresses the use case around Cardano. It is it is different than a lot of other cryptocurrencies in this in the context that it is it is not a meme coin. It is it is there really is not a lot of hype around Cardano. Um, a lot of people don't really know about Cardano. You know, it's one of those cryptocurrencies that is just to me very different than say a Dogecoin. And, I'm, and I, I like Dogecoin for different reasons, right? It's very different than a lot of different cryptos. And what I like about it is that it it's just, um, it does what it does very, very, very well. And and there's and there's a really uh, great chart that I found that I'm actually looking at that I kind of will, will kind of highlight for you that really talks about kind of the benefits and the risks associated with Cardano. So in this context of the kind of the, the reasons that I like Cardano, here you really go. Number one, the one of the benefits, the main benefits of Cardano is that it, it comes from a reputable team, uh, a, a very large development team. It, you know, Charles Hoskinson, who was one of the co-creators of Ethereum, created Cardano uh, from the ground up. I just really, really like that. Okay, that's one of the benefits. Uh, so another benefit of it is that it's extremely extremely environmental friendly there's not a lot of carbon footprint around you know around the mining of cardano and things like that so it's really really cool in that context another huge big reason i really like cardano is that it's peer reviewed technology okay and so everything it just I, I i can't i just can't stress enough why i really like this uh, additionally it's extremely scalable um and and but also there is substance here versus hype. Um, I like Dogecoin because of the hype surrounding Dogecoin, right? That's what I love crypt that's what I love about the crypto market is there's a different crypto for every single use, right? Uh, I mean there's crypto uh, for everything from uh, the adult industry you know to Cardano, right And so there's in and everything in between. And so, um, I think that Cardano for me is one of the pillars uh, that I'm going to be holding for a, tr for a long time to come, years and years and years, uh, that is different for the reasons that I have, you know, like a Dogecoin, right, as an example. And they're just fundamentally different and, and they're fundamentally different and they're fundamentally different and for, for owning for different reasons. And Cardano, you know, is it... It just, um, you know, like for example, they, they they have a partnership with the Ethiopian Ministry of Education where they are um, creating technology that is tamper-proof that gives identity management and records and uh, for five million students and teachers. I mean, that's profound, right? Uh, and the fact that they are specifically going into and trying to help develop um, uh, in, in work in developing nations that is profound okay um, I think that 
everything that they're doing in uh, I just really really like for example another one I, another reason I really like him is Charles Hoskinson I love that he is this extremely vocal ambassador for Cardano out there and you know uh, he and Mark Cuban started talking and, and had this kind of really positive back and forth and uh, you know and, and Charles you know stepped up and and you know and started interfacing with Mark and all this kind of stuff and I like that he's out there as this extremely you know tech guy but yet who can relate and and talk about the technology and talk about Cardano and and everything that they're doing and it it just is creating this really cool scenario where he is this amazing ambassador out there um, helping proliferate you, you know um, Cardano and I think it's 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 just a scenario that you can see today. The, today's word of the day is scenario. That's the word I use, I'm using today. <laughs> I really am. I just I love that. I love this particular um, this particular uh, crypto because it, it. Another reason going back is it distinguishes itself through a commitment to peer reviewed scientific research. I wanted to get that right, so you saw me. I, I clicked over and uh, looking at that. So. Um, that's one thing it's, it's, you know, it's peer reviewed and it is an alternative to Ethereum. Okay. Um, and both platforms are used for similar applications, smart contracts, smart contracts, um, are coming for Cardano. That's a big, huge deal. Okay. Uh, but you know, Cardano in the fact that they kind of went down this main road of identity management and traceability and those things like that, I think that all of that's coming into play to help them continue to become one of the main um, cryptocurrencies out there that I just see continuing to evolve as a a really strong company, um, excuse me, a really strong crypto in the overall crypto space. You know, right now their their price action is, uh, you know, it's been trading around the dollar seventy range and. Uh, in that kind of in that in that particular scenario, it's ranked number five out of all of the cryptocurrencies, uh, you know, and they have kind of are trading in this, you know, mid dollar fifty dollar sixty to kind of high dollar, you know, high dollar seventy eighties range. What I like about what I'm seeing with Cardano is that I think at this price point, I think it's one of those scenarios where scenario again, you could even do a drinking game to that every time I say scenario. Um, I like that at this price, it's one of those things where it's very, very, um, am I trying to say to you, it you could buy in at these levels and then it continues to, uh, you can you can get a lot of bang for your buck, you know, at, at a dollar seventy per, per token. Uh, and then kind of, you, you know, you can, I mean, I think that the sky's the limit. I think that this could be a, Ten dollar um, coin by the end of the year. I definitely think that that's possible. I definitely think that in that in that there's so much upside here. And uh, now the overall crypto market has got to help us. You know, we've got to get Bitcoin above forty thousand. We got to get Ethereum to follow suit, and all those kind of things. Cardano uh, is one of those that will, uh, I think. Uh, it, it rides with the rest of those, you know, as, as all the other cryptos really do at the end of the day, you know, where Bitcoin and Ethereum go, Cardano does and Dogecoin and, and Polygon and all of them, they all, they all go themselves. Now, I think that Cardano absolutely stands on its own and it will continue to evolve and continue to develop and continue to be one of those cryptos that is here. I think that it is overlooked and undervalued by the overall market it's not sexy it's not there's no hype around it uh, but that's okay with me it's one of those cryptos that I think that will stand the test of time and continue to evolve and be one of the main pillars uh, in the overall crypto market which is why it's one of the main ones that I have in my cryptocurrency portfolio one that I really really like so that's the reason I want to make this video was to just kind of say hey here's some reasons that I really like Cardano and I think uh, for me it stands out among the others for very for these reasons and um, anyway hope you enjoyed this video I'll, uh, I'll I'll be back later on take care